What up? It's time to do 2018 Chrome Baseball Hobby. I'm sorry, Chrome Baseball Jumbo. Huge difference. This is a Jumbo half case, uh, number a 40. Big Greg, that's honestly, that's literally what I do every night. You know, sometimes before I come in, you know, I, I do like a, a little bowl or or, or, or or what would it equate to a bowl, you know, to, to, to loosen me up. And then by the time it's time to stream, you know, I'm chilling. And then to end the night, I face a whole blunt. And that definitely helps me go to sleep. Because I, I have problems going to sleep. Which is a, another story for another day. Hey, would you look at that? It's Ryan and Matt in the head-to-head -head matchup again. Looking at like four, maybe five. Shoot, maybe, man, I'm probably not going to get out of here until like six in the morning. Whatever. Things need to get done, they're going to get done. Simple as that. So, Ryan, you definitely need that. Like, I don't have to worry about nothing else, but that Diamond Icons needs to ship later today. For sure, for sure, correct? Just want to make sure. And uh, good luck to the both of you. Oh, wait, hold up. What's wrong with me? Yo. Good luck, everybody. Oh, dude, it's, it's not if it's possible. Definitely possible. If that's what you want done, that's what's going to happen. So I just wanted to make sure. I'll take care of it, so I'll, I'll, uh, I'll bag your stuff up during the off time. McMahon, Rockies rookie. Yankees, D.D. Gregorius insert. Jimenez Tigers insert. Zach Granite of the Twins. Rookie auto. Ryan, no problem, man. Woodruff Brewers rookie. Davis Astros rookie. I'm just going to go through this. Dude, seriously, what is that stuff on the back of some of these cards? It almost kind of feels like glue, kind of. A redemption for Harrison Beater. Purple Refractor Parallel, Harrison Bader is a Cardinal. Very nice. Jose Ramirez, purple for the Indians.
So far, I got two autos. Come on, Super. JD Davis of the Astros. The rookie auto. Herman Marquez of the Rockies. A little gold. That's the 50. To play. Tomas Nito came out to play for the Mets. Rookie auto. To Taco Bell or not to Taco Bell? That is the question. Bryce Harper of the Nationals green. Dude, I wonder what that Bryce Harper 101 is going to look like. This one's the 99. Dude, I forgot we hit that Bryce Harper 101, dude. Me neither, dude. I'm, tr I'm trying to get it done here. This is Trevor Williams of the Pirates to 499. down well the baiters are redemption it's a purple refractor parallel so purples are usually numbered uh, to 299, 250. Yeah, I believe that Bader refractor, uh, purple refractor parallel redemptions is going to be to 299. I want to see a Super Otani. I don't know if it's been pulled yet in Chrome. It probably has been, but but hey, if it hasn't, here we go. Come on. That would be a great way to end the night. Or just any Otani auto, really, because... I, I have yet to see an Otani autograph out of Chrome. I have I haven't seen it and I personally have not pulled it. So I want to pop that cherry. Again, what is this stuff, man? It's a base card, so whatever. But still, it's the principle. A blue Calhoun for the Rangers to 150. Uh, Tyrone Guerrero, the rookie auto for the Marlins.
Man, that's a great question, dude. I mean, obviously it depends on the condition of the card, if it's graded or not, and what it what what it will get graded or what the grading would be to. But like, let's say it, it gets graded 9.5 BGS for that Otani Super, dude. Let's see. Earlier this year, wasn't I think there was a Super Otani? I forget the product. That thing that thing sold for like 50, 60 grand or something like that. Or I think I think even more actually. So it's, it's, it's got to be at least at least five figures, Dune. Again, the, the it was the Bowman Super, right? Yeah. I think that thi that thing sold for like seventy grand or something like that. Like a st over fifty stacks for sure. It sold. Raw, you know, usually raws don't 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 sell for for more than a, a card that's graded, for example. But dude, I, I honestly I don't know. What do you think, Ryan? You you are more the aficionado than I am. I, I am just a talent. I'm, I'm I got the nice hands. That's that's about it. Hunter Wood of the Rays rookie auto. Cause yeah, dude. Cause I I dude I, I don't collect. Uh, I'm really not like in the hobby. Like, I, you know what I mean? Like, I, I don't collect, I don't sell, I don't buy. So, like, uh, I'm kind of just like, no idea. You know, I, I do learn a little bit, a little bit every day. But yeah. Trevor Williams, Pirate Rookie Auto. But, but as far as, like, what a card is worth. I'm going to tell you what everybody seems to tell me. Whatever somebody's willing to pay for it. A Roddy Red of the Nationals. There you go. Nationals hitting for Matt. Roddy Red to 150 Nationals. Nice. A Cody Allen Indians negative. All right, halfway there. Need something big, baby. Come on. Well, you missed it earlier, Dune. I pulled an Otani Redemption out of Diamond Icons Baseball. And I also hit a uh, a Buster Posey 101 autograph, in the in I think in the same box. Not to toot my own horn here, but uh, I've been hitting some pretty na I hit I've hit some pretty nasty stuff. There was that Bryce Harper 101 redemption that I hit as well. When you're hot, you're hot. What can I say? I hit a Kobe Bryant autograph earlier. Not a one-on-one, -on -one, but still. Kobe Bryant auto. A Shaq Hilo Neal Redemption. And a Jerry West auto in the same case of Nor Basketball. Well, the Otani Redemption, the, the Buster Posey one-on-one, -on -one, the Bryce Harper one-on-one, -on -one, that came out of D Diamond Icons Baseball Dune, which is a, uh, a high-end product. Not for the faint of heart. Very pricey stuff. We're talking $1,500 a box pricey. 
You know, either either I'm gonna pay my mortgage this month or I'm gonna buy this box of Diamond Icons baseball kind of deal. Yep, that was on the website. You know, you know, we 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 do stuff with eBay, of course, Dune. But like all of our high end, all of the new stuff is is strictly for the website. Dude, could you imagine if I tried to sell Diamond Icons on eBay? Dude, I would get raped on that. So, you know, truth be told, I use eBay to help me bring in more customers and, and, and kind of just really dump some of the uh, the kitty product, I call it. Victor Arano, Phillies rookie. I mean, dude, you don't, you don't have to, but I would... I would you know, my thing is this, like, I don't see any reason why you shouldn't do both eBay and the store. You know, because with eBay, you can get some really good deals, of course. But, you know, with our website, dude, there's the daily giveaways of $100, which we do every day. There's the weekly hit list giveaway. If you don't get a one-on-one, a relic, or an autograph and a break, you're automatically thrown into the weekly uh, hit list giveaway where you could win up to multiples of hundreds of dollars. And then there's the monthly giveaway, which is simple. You just buy into a break for that month. And depending on how many breaks we fill for the month, we give away, you know, uh, money to one person. So, like, for example, last month, somebody won over $2,000 in break credit just with that one person. You know, we, we don't do any giveaways. Truth be told, we're kind of giving away some of this stuff on eBay already as it is. Uh, but yeah, all of our promotions and giveaways and all the fancy stuff and the new products, that is only for the website. Uh, but Dune, I mean, Diamond Icons, man, it, it, it would have been, you know, thank God for Ryan. Ryan Ryan honestly saved me on that one. But uh, yeah, dude, Diamond Icons probably would have sat in the store for months. You know, I probably would have done that as a, as a hit random where everybody gets a hit. It would have been ten spots, oh, you know, close to one hundred and sixty dollars for a spot. Get a guaranteed hit. You know, not too many people willing to to spend that kind of coin. And had I done it as a PYT, you know, to me, dude, you know, it would have been a box. It, it, or if we or if we tried to do a full caser, you know, at least half of the teams would not get a hit. So, you know, with high end products like that. You, you got to get creative, and, and you know what I mean? It also helps to have people like Ryan, you know, on your on your team, so to speak. But, yeah, we're, we're probably not going to get any more icons. That that stuff is that stuff is not cheap, dude. We're talking six grand. Six grand for a case. It's, it's just ridiculous. Syndergaard of the Mets. That is a photo variation. That's the effort. Yeah, dude, you, you know, if you have a Ryan on your team, it, it definitely makes life easier. Yeah, but, you know, me and Jason were trying to figure out ways how to how to put the, the other case of the diamond icons. And then, lo and behold, Ryan was like, you know what? I got you, boys. And then Karma came right back to him, and he got really nice stuff. Felix Jorge of the Twins, rookie blue. That's the 150. You saw one breaker do 29 spots, $240 a spot. What was it, a case break or a, a box break? Giovanni Gallegos of the Yankees to 499. Hold up, let me do that math right quick. Well, damn. Well, I was going to say, yeah, for a case, I mean, who am I how to tell that person how to do their business? You know, if, if they have if they had done it like 210 a spot, okay, understandable. But 240, now you're kind of pushing it. 
you know, that's why I don't really, that's why I don't, like, with the high-end products like Diamond Icons, I'm not a fan of doing PYTs, because more than half of the spots aren't going to get anything. So with products like that, I really like doing hit randoms, because at least that way, you ha you will, guaranteed, you will get something. So, it may not be an autograph, it may not be the team you want, but at least you have something to show for your $150, $200 purchase. Whereas you could buy the eight, you could, you know, you could spend six, seven hundred dollars on the Yankees and not get a single card. And and then you're probably not gonna feel too good about that. So you know that 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 high end stuff is uh It is a, it's a doozy. It's a doozy. Felix Jorge of the Twins, Rookie Auto. Or Ryan, you know, you, you could always just buy the whole case yourself, too. There's, there's also that. Dude, Ryan, I'm telling you, bro. If I had, like, five more of you for baseball, ten of you for basketball, and ten of you for football, I, I, I would... I would... I would retire Jason... I'd retire my mom, pay off all my student loans, and fucking take over this breaking business. And you don't see me on Sports Center and shit. Doing breaks with Linda, Linda Cohn or whatever. You know, on first take with Stephen A. doing a break. Dylan Peters, uh, Dylan Peters Marlins rookie. Tanner Scott, Orioles rookie auto. Maybe it's just me, but this case, this half of the case anyway, has been a little eh. It's been a little eh. All it takes is one, though. Let's get a big autograph in this last box here. Are you for real? The Jets kicked Teddy Bridgewater off the bus after the trade when the trade happened. That's kind of crazy. Ronald Herrera, Rangers rookie auto. Well, let's see if your prayers come to fruition in this last box, Ryan. Here we go. We're gonna have to try to get some more of this Chrome baseball stuff, especially since they push back. The, uh, the Bowman. The Bowman Chrome. Well, that's New York. That's, New that's the Jets for you. Mm, they, they don't know what they got. And even when they do, they still treat them like crap. Dude, Jets fans are, are, are freaking some of the worst. You feel me, Ryan? Dude, I really want Teddy Bridgewater in a Dolphin uniform, bro. That that guy, before he got injured and missed out basically two years, more or less, he was crushing it for the Vikings. Like He looked like he was poised to be the next big thing at quarterback for Minnesota. And then that disgusting injury happened, and people just seemed to forget how good that kid is in Louisville, man. In college, that kid was lights out. And I heard he was doing really well for the Jets. I guess that's why they traded him. So they could get some form of value from him. You know, it's better than him just riding the bench, I guess. I mean, I'm a little upset, though, that the Dolphins didn't, didn't make a go at him. I really, I really like Bridgewater, man. And he's a South Florida kid, too. So, like, you know what I mean? Dude, if Miami, like, if the Miami Dolphins could keep their talent, like, in 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 state, like, if we could draft players from the University of Miami, Florida State, and, and 
you know, you have homegrown players play for the Dolphins. Oh my God, we would be amazing. But anyways, let's box Mojo. Let's see what we got here. Get some baseball. Super Otani. Oh hell yeah, dude! I was gonna say Drew Brees is you know he's getting up there in age. So Teddy Bridgewater gonna be a nice smooth transition hopefully. Uh, Dune, we uh, we send it to uh, to eBay. Rizal Iglesias, numbered out of uh, to fifty for the Reds. If you win, if you win a bid, if you win an auction of ours on eBay, if you read the description of the listings, in addition to any cards for your team for that break, we also send you either a random base card, a random um, vintage card, or a random pack of cards. Uh, it depends on our on our on our availability so lately what we've been doing is we've been sending base cards to the uh, to the eBay folks so even even though you don't even if you may not get a hit at least you'll have like a base card or something like a stack of base card or something Paul Blackburn to 499 of the A's I realize it's not much but it's better than nothing Oh, Drew Brees can still play for like at least another two years. This year and like another one or something. Chicka chicka wow wow. Where's where's the where's the Otani super? Show yourself. Exactly, you know, be better than getting skunked. You know, and we try to, like, for example, let's say you win the Cubs, and your Cubs don't get a hit. You know, we, we, we're, we're not going to spend hours rummaging through all our base to try to find you a Cubs card, but we do a really good job of at least, you know, giving you your team in your auction. So if you win the Cubs, we try to throw in a Cubs base card or something. You know what I mean? There's the Caratini. Rookie auto for the Cubs. Damn, it's almost 3 in the morning. Are you... Oh, my God. It's going to be one of those days. Or nights, I guess. For sure better than getting skunked. Jackson Stevens of the Reds. Rookie auto. Dustin Fowler, A's rookie auto. And I think we should get one more. Come on, Otani. The time is now. Last tag mojo. Good luck. Matt and Ryan. Ah, there it is. Alex Mejia. The Cardinals rookie auto. And that's probably going to do it. But I could be wrong. Let's see. Nice. Victor Robles with the rookie debut medallion for the Nationals. There you go, Matt. Getting a little something something. Yeah, Ryan. For sure. I mean, there were some nice things here and there. But it definitely could have been a lot better. Jackie Bradley Jr. of the Red Sox Purple. To 299. And that's going to do it for the break. So, here comes the recap. We got two negatives. Cody Allen Indians, Dylan Peters Marlins. A Noah Syndergaard Mets photo variation. Let's see. Two purples. 
Jose Ramirez Indians, 299. Jackie Bradley Jr., Red Sox, 299. Bryce Harper of the Nationals, 299. Felix Jorge of the Twins to 150. Willie Calhoun Rangers to 150. Rizeli Glacius of the Reds to 50. And a Herman Marquez of the Rockies to 50. We also have a Victor Robles Nationals rookie debut medallion. But now for the autos. We got Mejia Cardinals, Fowler A's. Stevens Reds, Caratini Cubs, Herrera Rangers, Scott Orioles, Jorge Twins, Arano Phillies, uh, Trevor Williams Pirates, Hunter Wood Rays, Flaherty Cardinals, Guerrero Marlins, Nito Mets, Davis Astros, Granite Twins, Paul Blackburn of the A's to $4.99. Giovanni Gallegos Yankees to 499, Roddy Red of the Nationals to 150, and Trevor Williams Pirates to 499, and a rookie auto purple refractor parallel of Harrison Bader Cardinals. And that was the break, my friends. Thank you very much. We'll get it out to you.